Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I thought I would show you guys a no heat curling technique that I've been doing for a few years now and I haven't seen it on YouTube yet. So I thought I would share that with you. I have let my hair air dry most of the way. I've brushed it. The ends are a bit dry so I am going to just wet them a little bit. This is just water. Just want it to be slightly damp, not too wet. Otherwise you're gonna be waiting forever for it to dry because it is no heat. This side as well. I thought I would just point out that this technique I have tried on pin straight hair um, and it, with me trying it, it hasn't worked. Uh, it might work for you, it depends on your hair texture, but I know for curly hair it does definitely work. So first of all, I'm just gonna part my hair properly down the middle. Sorry, I'm looking at the mirror behind the camera. And that looks good. And continue down the back. I did this in two sections, but you can do it in as many as you'd like. If you'd like tighter curls, you can do maybe four sections. But I find that two sections works really well for me. So I'm just gonna brush it one more time. Add a little bit more water on the ends. do this, all you need is your hands. I'm going to start right here at the crown of my head with my shorter hair, my bangs, and I'm going to pull it back and twist. And every time I grab a new section, I'm going to incorporate that into the twist. So grabbing hair from the front, you can also grab hair from the back, like that, and you're just going to twist it down, also combing through your hair as you pull it down so it doesn't get all lumpy and weird and you're going to have weird kinks in your hair. So make sure you're combing your hair all the way through. Try to do it as tight as possible. And then when I get to around here, I just take a clip that looks like this, and I just secure to my scalp like that. And then I keep going down now because my hair is naturally curly, I don't need to put clips in this if I'm just waiting for it to dry during the day. However, if I go to bed, I'll put some clips, like just butterfly clips going down the braid or the twist so that it holds while I'm sleeping. So you just go all the way down and my ends are a bit dry still. And you want them to be slightly damp so that they take to the curls. And then just like that, I'm gonna leave it and I'll watch a movie or I'll do something and I'll just continuously twist like that until it's completely air dry. So I'm gonna go ahead and do the other side and then wait for this to dry and I'll come show you the results. Okay, so it's been about an hour. My hair is completely dry and staying in its twist, as you can see. So let's go ahead and take these out. I'm just gonna comb through with my hands. Really bouncy. What I like about this is I've got really frizzy hair and it tames my top half of my hair. So it's not all frizzy and going crazy. And then the ends are just really beautifully curled. not frizzy and that was all done without any heat so it's not damaging to your hair and like I said you can use this method while you sleep you just put a few more clips in to keep it from coming undone but that's it I really hope you guys enjoyed this I hope it works for you keep in mind if you've got straight thin hair it might not work as well or at all so this is more for the textured hair girls but 
I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give me a like and don't forget to subscribe to see more of my content.